So chimps have a sense of justice and they can cooperate with people. Can they collaborate spontaneously with each other? Researchers also from the Max Planck Institute placed fruit on a board just out of a chimpanzee's reach. The chimps are behind bars, both to keep them from the food and because they can be impulsive, strong, and dangerous. When a solo chimp can reach both ends of a rope, it hauls them in and gets all the food. But on some trials, the ends are too far apart. If the chimp pulls just one end, the rope unthreads. The chimp has another option. He can unlock a door to bring in a helper who's been watching. The two chimps now work together. But a series of trials shows that this teamwork doesn't come easily. The helper must be a friend, and the food divided into separate dishes. Can a more loving ape cooperate better? At Lola Yabanobo Sanctuary in the Congo, victims of the pet trade are raised by human mothers. When these bonobos grow up, they will spend their days outdoors, becoming savvy about life in the forest. Bonobos are the most social of the great apes, and in their groups, all friends are friends with benefits a simple way to diffuse tension. Calmer than chimps, how do bonobos do on the cooperation test? The bomb, the bomb. Brian Hare places food in a central shared well. Okay, ready? One, two, three. All the food is in the same dish, so it's very easy for one individual to bump the other individual out of the way and steal it all. Okay, Nikasi. One, two, three, go! It takes the bonobos a while to get on task. But soon they get the hang of it. With their more congenial temperaments, Bonobos are more cooperative than chimps are. <laughs> 